Hello everybody, and this is the ninth part of Let's Play Sonic Adventure The X Director's Cut Chow Help. This is the the first part of our neutral swim no. Our neutral fly chow. Um as you can see Nathan looks very, very different already. He's um turning purplish, dark purple, and he's got little jester spike things sticking out of the back of his head, which are turning dark blue on the ends, and his head, the very tip of his head is yellow, and he has dark yellow arms, and a dark yellow backside. And, yeah, so that's Nathan so far, I'll be back. And it's actually only been 20 minutes, so he looks like this only after, or after only 20 minutes. So I think that's pretty awesome, because, uh, normally it takes a while for them to look like that. So anyway, I'll be back when he's pretty close to evolving to see what he looks like then, and then I'll be back- Oh, he's flipping! You guys haven't seen- That's the swallow trait, they flip. Anyway, that's pretty cute. I'll be back when he's about to evolve, and then I'll be back again when he actually evolves. So I'll see you guys soon. Bye. Hello, everybody, and welcome back. Um, I am here with Nathan, and as you can see, he looks a lot different than he's right about as he is about to evolve. Um, he is now pinkish instead of dark purple. His tips on his jester spike things and his stomach are dark blue instead of... The stomach was yellow, I think. Um, his, the tip of his head and his arms, his hands, are now completely orange, and so is his backside. And so, yeah, he's really, really, really close to evolving, and his ball is yellow. Pure yellow now. It was, like, a darker yellow before, I guess. Um... He'll probably evolve right now, so I should stop picking him up. Oh, and remember, go out of the garden every once in a while, half an hour, an hour maybe, because if you don't, and something happens to your GameCube, or Wii, or a device that you're using, and it shuts off, or your mom pulls a cord on accident, or your siblings turn it off without knowing what it is, then you will lose all the progress since the last time you entered the garden. So... Make sure to go out every once in a while so that you won't have to completely remake the chow. <sighs> well, as you see, he looks very different than what he used to, especially than when he started out. And we're going to feed him this fruit, and I will be back in a few when he is actually evolving. So I'll see you guys later. Bye. Alright, you guys, this is it. Um, one thing that I forgot to point out the last time someone evolved, which was Slippy... Chow normally evolve right after they wake up from a nap. So if they're really looking like they're supposed to, and they just took a nap, or they're in the middle of a nap, expect them to evolve when they wake up. And if they do not evolve when they wake up, they will evolve shortly after. So he literally just woke up, and he's still in the same position. He just woke up and sat there, and he's in that position, and he just starts evolving immediately. So he's going into his little cocoon thing again, and it's perfect that he's evolving on the stairs, because now we can make him fly when he's a neutral fly chow. Which is also, by the way, called a basic knight's chow. I told you yesterday there was such a thing as a knight's chow. Um, this is called a basic knight's chow, because it looks like a simpler form of the full form knight's chow. So some chow have nicknames, not all chow have nicknames, but some. So this, like I said, would be the basic Knight's nice Chow. What a peaceful place. It is peaceful. I love it in the Chow Garden. I wish I could come and live there with the Chow. You can see his tail poking out. From the, his swallow tail. That's awesome. Anyway, this is what he looks like now. You guys can't see him fully yet, but I already know what he's going to look like. So in my opinion, he looks completely, completely different. And he's got, um... Let's see, first of all, his swallow wings got bigger. Second of all, he's actually pink now. Third of all, his ball is orange instead of yellow. Sec uh, fourth, his jester spikes things. They're going out and then curving to the sides, and they're striped. And now he's blue instead of orange, except for now his stomach is orange. Anyway, I think he is, like, adorable. This is one of my favorite chow ever. We're gonna try and make him fly, and then I'll end the part. And this is Nathan, our neutral fly chow. Go, go, there we go. There we go! He's flying! Yeah, you rock, alright. Oh yeah, like I said, you can whistle and then they'll come running to you. Yay, he's running to us, even though he can't walk yet, because we haven't fed him anything for him to walk. 
Anyway, that is Nathan. Thank you guys for watching. I had a fun time raising this chow, and I will see you guys tomorrow when we make a our nice chow. So once again, thank you for watching, and I'll see you later. Bye.